All right, we're here with Kentucky Wesleyan's men head basketball coach, Happy Osborne. Coach, practice just got underway. Can you talk about the new team, all the several new players who just joined the squad? Yes, Daniel. We, uh, you know, we returned three guys that played last year, Kendra Bosley, Jordan Jacks, two of our top players, as well as an ever-improving Adam Stanford. I'm, I'm pleased with our recruiting year. Uh, you know, we've had some bad breaks. Colton Elkins is out at least this semester with a really bad concussion. I would ask for all Wesleyan fans to please pray for him as he's having a hard time recovering. Uh, he'll have to withdraw. And then, you know, we're going to be down to eight scholarship players because Malik Harris will not be eligible until Christmas. And, that, you know, that puts us in a little bit of a bind. But the other side of it is, is we've got great faith in Adam Sanford and Justin Lucas, and I think those guys will do the job. And guys that we were counting on no matter what. Um, I like our team. We have a long way to go. We have pieces. You know, we've not been under a whole lot of adversity yet other than what I can put them under, which I try to on a daily basis. And, uh, you know, it's a team with a lot of upside, but it's a team with a long way to go. Can you talk a little bit about the uh, senior leadership from Kenja and Jordan? And uh, uh, Kenja, Jordan, and Adam have all three done a great job. Uh, you know, when your captains and, and your top players are your hardest workers, that's something that, you know, really, really helps. And, you know, Jordan and Kenja and Adam all played in the NCAA all tournament last year. They know what it feels like to to win the conference tournament and have that opportunity. And obviously they want more, but, you know, they, they've done a fine job. Uh, you know, I've got no complaints with any of those three. And as you already just talked about earlier, only three returning players. What do you have a couple things in your mind of challenges straight away that? Are... Well, offensively, obviously, you know, we're set oriented. And we've got a lot to learn and a lot to pick up in a short time. Uh, you know, if, if the NCAA would let me run it, we would have those eight hours a week that you could do anything with instead of just the two, and that would really, really help us. But, you know, other people face the same thing. So, you know, our biggest challenges are just coming together as a team, and, you know, they really like each other. They're a fun group. I enjoy coaching them. Uh, I mean, it's just, you know, it's just people need to give us some patience. And then lastly, two exhibition games coming up in less than a couple of weeks. You just talked about the way you're preparing for uh, both Louisville and Western. We also have a very hard scrimmage that we're not allowed to name names and talk about, but against a very good team. And, uh, you know, I'm trying to put them in the fire. That's what we're trying to do. I think Louisville's better than they were last year. I think Western Kentucky has recruited outstanding, as, all, as Rick Stansbury always does. Uh, be a tremendous challenge for us. It's fun, you know, to be able to go to the Yum Center, be able to go down to Diddle. That's a great opportunity for our players. You know, we're a long, long way today on October 19th of being ready for November 3rd or November 5th. But, you know, that's how it is, and we got two weeks to get there. We just got to make every day count. All right, Coach, thank you for your time. Good luck this season. It's always a pleasure spending quality time with you, Dave. Right, we're here with Kentucky Wesleyan basketball senior guard, Kenja Bosley. Kenja, you're the only four-year uh, senior on this team. Can you just talk about the leadership you've been trying to instill into this year's team? Um, yeah, I'm basically just trying to tell these guys what I know. I mean, I know everything that Happy wants. I've uh, been here four years. So uh, basically, I'm just trying to let the guys what happy ex let let the guys know what happy expects and things of that nature, and just uh, try to lead as much as I talk uh, lead as much as possible, be vocal and things like that. And can you just talk a little bit about uh, practices and training and everything getting underway. Uh, practices have been good. We've been uh, happy's always going to push us, so they're always going to be tough. But uh, we've gotten better every day, and that's all you can ask for, really. So uh, we're just taking baby steps right now. We're not uh, really thinking ahead. We're just trying to take each day uh, as it is. You averaged 16 points a game last year. Uh, is there anything you've been trying to work on in the offseason and up till now? Um, I'm pretty not. I mean, I've, I've worked on my game, obviously, but I work on all aspects of my game. Uh, I'm not a perfect player by any means. So I, I work on everything. But uh, basically, one thing I, that I worked on mostly is just being more vocal. And uh, that's really something that you can't work on the offseason. That's something that you work on when you're with your guys, and that's what I'm really trying to work on the most. There's only uh, three players on this year's team that played valuable minutes last year, and you, Jordan Jacks, and Adam Stanford. Uh, what do you think are going to be the toughest challenges with this year's team? Um, I think the toughest challenge is uh, just getting the camaraderie. Uh, it's a it's a new team, and uh, it's it's going to be hard. Uh, I mean, the heat the heat back when LeBron was on got together. You know, they crazy talented team started nine and eight. Uh, they didn't have the camaraderie yet. So, I mean, that's the sum we're going to have to work on. But uh, Happy always says UK gets new guys every every year. So uh, why can't we 
be just as good in, in the D2 level. And lastly, you got a couple exhibition games coming up. Rematches of last year, Louisville and Western. Can you just talk about the excitement level for those games? Uh, I'm really excited for that. Uh, both those games. We competed well in both those games. I would uh, like to win both of them. But uh, we're just going to go into those games thinking to win. You can't think that you're going to lose against anybody. And, uh, you know, uh, against Louisville, we know that uh, – they, they're going to impress us and put a lot of pressure on us, and we've been working on that in practice uh, all, every day. So uh, we're going to be ready for them. And then also Western, you know, they've got a new coach, Stansberry, so uh, they're going to be a new, improved team as well. But uh, we're going to be ready for them as well. All right, Kendra, thank you for your time. Good luck this season. Thank you. All right, we're here with senior forward Jordan Jacks. Jordan, can you just talk about practices and every training and everything that just got started going underway? Uh, we just finally got done with our conditioning. Um, it was pretty pretty tough, 6 a.m. sometimes. But I feel like the team has made huge strides, coming as one, building as one. Um, practices, um, we're getting after it, and I feel like we'll be ready for November 3rd against Louisville. Can you talk a little bit about the team just in general? There's a lot of newcomers. Just The only returners are you, who played Bobby Minutes, you, Kenja Bosley, and Adam Stanford. Uh, I like the new the new guys that coach has brought into this team. I, I feel like we gel a lot better than um, any team I've been on, and we're really talented. And I feel like um, if we can just keep on pushing each other and practicing, everything will work out. You were second in scoring last year, first in rebounds. You finished 12th in the nation from double doubles. Can you just talk about uh, your play last year and also what you've been trying to implement and improve on for this season? I've been working on a lot of stuff over the summer, ball handling, shooting, free throws, um, passing. Um, I'm just trying to get myself better so I can make my teammates better. Um, for me being a senior now, it's my last year, and I just want to I'm saying, get that national ninth championship for Kentucky Wesleyan. Like you were saying, senior, uh, can you talk a little about the way you've been trying to be a leader, either on or off the floor? Yeah, um, me being a senior, I feel like I have more responsibilities than I had last year. Um, for the role I think I take is just being a um, positive guy, I try to stay positive when my teammates are down on or off the court. I feel like that's the big key, making sure everybody's doing the right thing. Um, but at the same time, have fun doing what we do. And lastly, uh, talked about a little bit earlier, just briefly, but the two exhibition games, rematches of last year, Louisville and Western, both games were fairly close and you actually had the lead for majority of the Western game and right there with Louisville. Uh, just give your uh, uh, that was, I feel like this is going to be really exciting. Um, like I said, we're, I feel like we're a lot more talented than last year and we gel a lot more better. I feel like we can give them again a run for their money and I feel like we can come out with a win this time. Alright Jordan, thank you for your time. Good luck this season. Thank you.